Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are playing Cyberpunk. We are continuing the series. Next time, uh, last time we are playing uh, Cyberpunk. We are have we having missions. Our mission now is to go at Jackie. Open to it. Man of the hour. I will just. I will, I will save this stock, I do it. it. It just saved me here, I don't know. I do have quickly attack, I don't want to stay for this stock, bro. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Okay. Some top notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. Are we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory new ride. Okay, now we are going. Follow Jackie. I will drive because I like to drive. We're doing again. First stop. Ripper Dock. And Holmes. Easy on the gas, huh? I just ate. What is a good bow? I was supposed to stop by Vix anyhow. Oh, wait a second. This is how I put this. Is this is the nice? Wait a second. What to show? This is the car we have. This is the our car. I forgot to show you the car. To show you exactly how it will looks the car. I like is you drive like GTA 5, but uh, more evolution. The car is more evolution, like uh, the future car, but more a little bit old. But it's very, but it's very awesome. You are just parking here. You have to park here. Yeah, this is it. Now we go. Find me once Vic's done that, sir. I accidentally pop a steam packed. I will draw my weapon. Oh, let's go, Bo. Okay, guys, we have to go here. This Japanese. Doctor Vector will see you now. We go. This is the location I have to go. This is the doctor. This is the doctor. Good to see you. This is the doctor. He's the the doctor. Need some new kit, but if this is the doctor. Is help? Is doing? Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddie. Chair, please. Sit down. And relax. Okay, I have to sit in this chair. If it we will do some upgrades of me or I don't know. Will do something to me. Kuroshi optics. Best I've got and should be about right under the circumstances. Now Jack in. You peruse and choose while I scan. See what's going on inside. I think I have to do. Mark one, like I said, decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Okay. I'm ready. Play that made. Just like that. Thanks. Now, uh, Play by play, though. Really, Doc? Makes it sound like a dentist. 
Always going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky Gannick hand. Could slip. Lights out for a minute, all right? He just, uh, I don't know what he's doing to. No, it's close this part because it's very scary. Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Now I connect it, I see. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. Take you a few seconds. I also. I'm a like a, I'm a cyborg. We are cyborg. It ought to work like a charm. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new sight. Shit, Victor, not bad. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. Go on, Now he... Okay, now I have to go. Now. I'll go now. Uh... Your heart chakra looks a little out of whack, babe. I can release it for you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. V, yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride. Okay. I'm ready now. I would answer. Listen, I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. I would just get this is this is this guy is he lost his hand and he have a new hand. Robot hand. Nice. It looks like a minor million is a, a rich guy. I can't escape from the conversation so Smelling near like posies without seeing your 30th? It's first place or no place, Dex. Cost isn't a factor. <laughs> Classic. I'd expect nothing less from eager, suckling you. Respect. Okay. Alright, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scab home. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip to be precise. Job's to grab it. Simple. Yeah. I'm guessing it belongs to a court. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. <laughs> Corps don't deserve special treatment. Shit. <laughs> you ain't playing around. I got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of eddies. You work this out? Got a plan? 
Two things. First is a conundrum with the male speaker. Needs act to resolve any of that. Second, the robin. Simple. The client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the two. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? It's hot in the shop. I got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing its thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, Convoy was carrying the Flathead, a little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high-grade military tech. Because if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat-out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his okay. friend named one Simon Randall, aka Royce, playing his obvious ass. He's just one high, yo, but high. No He's... No he aims to honor his predecessor's word. <sighs> I play this part because I play, but it's been hacked, so I have to do it again. Okay, Mug. Internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. So she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. Klein, what's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Okay. Any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End of convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, we'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person. Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. Okay, I'll escape the ride. You can do that. <clears throat> to make the game out shortly, and if you do, because it's very boring. It's very boring. The ride. One more thing, Mr. B. Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? Later now. Get out, I think. Jagster, talk to Dex. Yeah, <laughs> Gordito's a big deal. Yeah. Clint to want to check our pro cred, but to me it feels more like he tangled us up with Maelstrom and Militech. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clepped it, then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had a switch up in management. I right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent, too, but... I don't know how much help she stands to be. Ha! <laughs> Hang on. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. But he must know what he's doing. So, how you want to play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? I say we knock on Maelstrom's door first. Pound, actually. 
Orale. In that case, I'll hit the all foods and put my nose to the ground. Sniff around. Hasta luego. Okay, this is my mission. Okay, you have to do this mission. And guys, please subscribe to the channel, all the notifications if you want to do more videos. This is the two, the, uh, the, the episode two, episode two. And before I, I posted this on leap, but uh, as I said, you don't know me. Not of you subscribe to that video like because you no know, not you watch it. I understand this, so don't worry. I will do more episodes. Let me hear what you squared away. The decks are that. Let's. All right. Let's knock on their door. See if they even open up. I hate these Borg fuckers. It's had to be them. Just a gang like any other, right? Take the Valentinos. They follow. Ding ding chom, gotta get this done. Ding ding chom, gotta get this done. Hey, what you waiting for? Talk to Royce. Dex sent us. Main room. We've been waiting. Uh, cozy place. You could use a few plants, though. Oh, yeah. They look damn well prepared. Don't think I've ever seen security like this in a chow factory. Uh, gear from the Jack Convoy. Gotta be. Must have been all over it like maggots on dead meat. You hear about their boss, Royce? Dex mentioned him. Called him special. Get in the elevator! Fucking sheep! T zero D one two, called the Flathead. And the hell you care? Guy I represent already paid brick for it. I'm just here for the pickup. I can talk direct to Royce if necessary. Nah, you talk to me. Name's Tum Tum. Now couch. Planet. <sighs> Yes, 
down for a climb. Jack, over here. sit down. This ain't gonna end well, but shit. What? Take it. Thanks, I'm good. Whatever you say, strange edge princess. Here we go. Need to see it. Sue yourself. Fucking tricked out this thing. Dynamic thermal optic camo armor. Full cognitive immersion with a raven control. Pin down prototype actuators made of titanium vanadium Kevlar composite. And watch this! Fully integrated link too, so when the spider starts crawling up walls dangling from ceilings. Mm -hmm. Could lose you. Yep, we'll take it. Free. Sure. Let's break up. Brick got it. Uh, I don't see any fucking brick around here, do you? Come on. Can't expect me to pay for this thing twice. And who the fuck are you to say what can and can't be? You'll pay twice because I say you'll pay twice. Alright. You want the... Seeing as you already got the eddies for it. But, you know, you never... Dexter Deshawn. That's it. Dexter Deshawn. The lord ass who punching animal fucked half a Pacifica? <laughs> Maybe he ain't dead? No. He's alive, well, and kicking. So you're gonna... Bang. Bring it, cocksuckers! Here he is, the officer! I'm not on him! With you in a sec. Aim first, then blast them. Okay, guys. Line. Plus, I thought you loved me. Really, no other way.
Ladies and gentlemen, Jackie Webb. Let's go, bro. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, bro. Okay, bro. Oh, I will survive, bro. I have to use this, guys. I have to use this. No, I would, I would have stayed back, bro, okay?
What is a gun? What is a guys? Um, to switch a weapon. Okay, I will switch a little bit the weapon. I will switch this because I want to save. Go. Let's go. What is a gun? Maybe it's the same one. Maybe it's the same. So I will put that this more damage. Even if I have a lot of, I will try, guys. How to shoot, guy? What else? He died. I can't hear. Not far now. Exit close. Got him! Three times over! Keep winning! Kill the hit! I do have steam pack, so okay, Bo. So oh, I did. This is happening if you die. You have just to go. I'll get some. Oh, guys, I'm sitting packs. I will use this. I have just the steam packs. Not far now, I see. Careful now. Got it, bueno. Que chingados estás esperando? I so many steam packs. I'm 
Okay, guys, we are defeated. Oh, you don't reviving. He dead. Okay, I killed him. Oh, it's like a steam pack. Oh, just let's just go, guys. We are escaping, bro. So we are escaping from this. No begging, no debt, no court. That's the way to do biz. Tough to argue. Yeah. Opportunity and brotherly hate. But if you got the cojones and you know how to use them, you can do damn near anything. Unless you catch a bullet, stray or not. Even then, you go out with a bang, right? And the street will talk, the street will remember. Oh my god, he's here. now jack risk don't forget how are things looking mr v got the bot and how to go run into any trouble and what about the military angle sure of course there was trouble Royce couldn't have given two shits of you and Brick had shaken on it. How'd you get him on board? You used the corporal woman? Did it without Melotech holding my hand. Didn't want to risk it. So how'd you get that cat Royce to hand over the flathead? Only way I know that always works. Brute force. You got some balls, Mr. V. What about the meet with Evelyn Parker? Still on the to-do list. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That meat's the only thing that'll get you a chance at grabbing that chip. Park will be waiting for you at Lizzie's bar. Good luck. I have to go now. Okay. Okay, guys, uh, we have to go to the mission. Looking a little put out there, input. Interest you in a cream BD? Sure, and I go. Hold it, house rules first. There will be severe penalties for any un No. Someone. I really look. Mm hmm. Have fun, input. 
Welcome to Lizzie's. My, what a sweet little face you have. Hey. Get you something. I'm looking for Evelyn Parker. You know if she's here. Who's asking? Name's V. She and I have a uh, date. Well, V, it's a pleasure. I'm a Dale. Uh huh. Club. Evelyn Parker. I knew it was you as soon as you walked in. Why not say hello soon? I wanted to get a good look at you first. And? Like what you see? If I do... We'll be in... Nothing's wrong. Really? Girl, like, why don't you just do me the drink? I just told you. had a load to say about I no idea if Dex exaggerates a little a lot you got me just start a I've heard there are two kinds of fixer loyalty and predictability they let's You're... What? Only a... Look. Okay, I want to escape the talk because okay. I want to, to play. Now comes the best part. Follow me. Got something for you. Should help you plan. Brain dance from Compeki Plaza. How's a brain dance supposed to help? Need facts, not thrills. I think BDs are only good for fondling virtual tits. Jacking off to Okay. Yeah, now, it can be a very useful tool. Good for analyzing oh, details, rainbow. human perception, even boosted. Doesn't grasp exactly what you need. So what's on the tape? Yorinobu's suite. The glorious interior. You'll need to locate the relic yourself. Hope I grabbed enough detail to make that possible. Hold up. Mean to say you recorded this? Mm-hmm. BD rec implant. Why, you object? Supposed to be... Let's see... What? It's hard to say. This week, for sure, okay? V. The... Judy... Lags. Believe it or not, I'm no stranger to tact. In biz or life. Hey, there you are. This is V. Enough already. Hey, Judy. Compiled your BDF. Still pretty raw. Mm hmm. Believe me. How about. Think I can handle it. Let's just do this. Right oh. Sit down. Settle in. And we'll get you going. Okay, now I don't know what is this machine is. Uh, well, I will in the virtual reality. It's like uh, is V. It's like a VR. Okay. Hit me. Just promise me it won't hurt. It won't. 
Not this time. Now sit still. Look at me. Okay, now let's set the optics and other sensory sigs. Look smack into these two screens. Pretend it's an eye exam. Am I gonna have to do this calibration dance every time? Not necessarily, but it's worth the wait. Give me two more minutes and you'll see exactly. Boot it up. Version first, let you get your bearings, and we'll jump into editing. I'm now in the virtual, my brain is in a virtual reality, so it's like a VR, it's a VR, guys. So, well, play. this episode will be a one hour episode because I know I know it's a little bit plan simple, do nothing odd, don't get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Down, everybody, on the ground. What I see you kissing the flooring! Muddy! Now, or I will fucking drop you, I swear to God! Whoa! Yeah! Hey! Uh, uh, now! Before I blow your fucking head off! This is a video, this is a video in the game, in the virtual reality, and it's using the machine. Slow, deep breaths. Your cortisol and adrenaline spiked, but the soft activated your hormone blockers. Nothing happened. You're alive and well. That was too much. I felt, I feel the guy's pain is dressed you'll be fine now i've been in the virtual reality again Control and analysis mode, so move around, zoom in and out, whatever else you come up with. Think of it as your own little sandbox. So, analysis mode, you control playback, can even pause when you feel the need. Then you use the editor Plan console simple. to unpause. Do nothing odd. Try Don't it. get creative. You go in, snatch the cash, get out, and we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. Dream as hell, right? Well, that's not all. You can speed things up or rewind, whatever you like. Give it a try. Rewind. Roll it back to the top. Can I... So reset the recording. That'll take you right back to the beginning. Try it. Now for some fun. This here's why you came in the first place. In analysis mode, you get to view and even scan details of the enviro recorded by the BD roller. Focus on the heat. The gun this gonk gets from his buddy at the beginning. Now scan it. Plan simple. Do nothing odd. Don't get creative. 
You go in, snatch the cash, get out. And we sell the BD to those psycho freaks from the studio. Got it, got it. And remember, everything on full blast. They'll spot us extra for a wicked adrenaline high. Okay, on you go. Okay, right here. Analysis mode, you can ferret out background noise and conversations if the roller got close enough. This tech records everything, every little detail, even the sights and sounds the roller was never aware of. To see the sources of the recorded sensory signals, switch to the audio layer in the editor. Go ahead and try that now. Okay, good. Now you should see several sound signatures in the store. Choose one and hone in on it. Seriously, like what's happening right next to me. Yeah, it's how BD recording implants work. They pick up everything, all the elements in the background. Then an editor tweaks them, makes them pop. Keep playing with the sound, explore it a bit. We'll move on when you get bored. Sometimes you can analyze extra layers in the raw, stuff the roller is cyberware picked up. Like what? Ev's got Kiroshi optics that grab infrared. Meaning you should be able to grab heat signatures from her recording. Huh. Hello, nice. Now, let's wait till the guy punches out the gonk at the counter. Peeps, too. Walk up to the wounded chick. Try scanning her. That's like the limits of the reality recorded by the BD roller. The editor won't let you outside it. Make sense? Next thing, scroll forward to the part where our artist gets a lead injection. God. See that? They shot him and he never saw it coming. But you will. Here it comes. My favorite part of the game. See the blinking thing over the entrance? Okay, guys. Uh, quickly, I'll tell you. I'll have to end this video. Uh, uh, bye, guys. Ha, comment, like, and subscribe. And see you next time. Bye.